Oh, I see. Okay. And then we do this one. And then we do this one. <laughs> and we go back down. Okay, where is the other one up here? Here it is. And then, uh, there was another one, wasn't there? Perhaps? Oh, maybe not. Okay. Damn, this game is beautiful. This is so pleasant. How do you write music like this, honestly? Like, I, like Steven and I talk about this all the time, because he really likes writing music, obviously. And uh, he's talked a lot about being like a composer before. And I'm like, how do you, how do you, like, how does that even work? Do you think they start with, they, they must, they have to start with like, the scene first, right? Like they gotta, they gotta send you like, okay, here's the scene we filmed and you have to write the music to it. I think I've looked it up before too. Cause it's wild the way that people create music. And once you start paying attention to it, like in games and in, in movies and, and TV shows and stuff, like it's hard to ignore, you know, like you, you kind of notice when something falls a little flat, you know what I mean? Because it's meant to make you feel a certain way. You're supposed to... Is that new? You're supposed to, you know, it's supposed to make you feel certain emotions. It's That's the job of the, the music. I took a, a class once where they were talking about um, uh, how, like, the the visuals of a... Uh, of a... Uh, who should you call it? The visual, visuals of, like, a, a, a media, a piece of media. Um need to play like a direct part with the the music like they need to go hand in hand like you can't have one without the other and it's like that famous scene in in uh star wars that you always see that uh that is always used as an example of that where uh i don't even remember which movie it was i only saw star wars once <laughs> so i don't remember much it was like uh the one where like luke and leia and or luke and han are walking down an aisle to like Leia and wh whoever other royalty and uh, they're like getting awarded something but without the music there's like nothing really happening and to be fair if you take music out of something like if so if, if any piece of media is completely silent um, unless obviously it's like a horror movie or something it, it, if it's completely silent like it's gonna be pretty awkward um, cause they do need to work hand in hand. However, <laughs> there's definitely a limit to that. The scene should still be good. But there's just something really special about music in, in video games for me, at least lately. You know, the past, the past couple years I've been really intrigued by it. It's just something special. I guess you can kind of treat it like a movie, you know what I mean? Like there's, there's, you know, obviously there's an event happening. This, you could call this a scene, you know what I mean? Like you could call, you could call Claire running around on different parts of the island a scene, you know, or on the mountain. There we go. I just needed some better footing. Ooh, who are you? Oh, <laughs> all right. That's good for now. Oh, shit! Hello! We invented our own game. I think it's gonna be the next big thing. Claire! I formally challenge- You know that's a kid. Beach stickball. Ooh. Oh, they're so cute. How do you play? Step over to the other side of the court and I'll teach you everything I know. Let's go. I got my stick ready. Three simple rules. Rule number one, hit the ball with your stick. Yeah, hit it real hard. Rule number two, don't let it hit the ground. 
Rule number three, believe in yourself. That's the most important rule. I love you, little guy. Thank you. Characters look. Do I have to stay inside the box? I guess he didn't say that. Oh, I missed. Oops. You can never lose. When you play beach stick ball, everyone wins. Except if you pop the ball, then I guess you lose. That's really sweet. Coop game. Get a point for every pass we make. If we can get to 10 points, I'll give you a prize. Let's play. Wow, that was pretty impressive how you just got the ball over there. Two, three, frick. It counts. Of course the serve counts, because I have to hit it back. Okay. Fuck. <laughs> Alright, I can't get past five. Alright. One. <laughs> Oops, I hit the wrong button. Okay, okay. It's alright, it's alright, it's alright. It's happening. It's happening. I stopped counting. I, I, I don't know how I feel about them not having a counter on the screen. Super Mario Odyssey has a mini game like this and I fucking hate it because I'm so bad. Yeah, the volleyball one? That shit sucks, dude. You know why it sucks though? And I'll be real with you, because the first power moon you get from that is for 15 hits, right? Really not 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 so hard. It, it that, that's like that's pretty achievable, I think. The second one is 100. How are you going to have a power moon for 15 and then a power moon for 100? That's not fair. That's way too much. To get to 100 is so hard of that shit. I hate it. Oh, nice. Well, let's try. Okay, 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 go! Really nailed the kid archetype here. Okay, okay. Shit. I stopped counting. Just focus, just focus, just keep going, just keep going. Just keep going! <laughs> Frick, that wasn't 20. Damn it, it was so close. True! <laughs> Time to duel! I thought we were on the te same team! Frick. Okay. Ha! Uh, that was a bad one. I can get to 20. Oh. I love this little dude's character design. He's so cute. He it's it's cuz they all look like little penguins. That's why. Okay. 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 Oh. Okay. I am the Bastic Ball Master. No one can stop me. Undefeated. What do you think the record is for this? <laughs> How long do you think someone would just sit here and do this? How long do you think someone could go? I feel like we made it to 20. I stopped counting, but like... Dude! Nice! Holy moly! Oh shit! <laughs> he gave us all his money! My family's rich! <laughs> nice! Baseball cap! Oh, he gave us his hat! Oh, sweet angel! Let's put on the hat. To commemorate that time, I got 30 points in beach stick ball. Hell yeah! Hi, Julie! Oh, they're so cute. All right, so where's the uh We'd be looking for the cemetery. Okay. 
Well, we have the money for the homeboy now. If I can give... Oh, here's a cemetery. Oh, it's raining now. Okay, I saw him over there. I'll be there in a second. But I want to just check everything out. Can I interact with anything? No, it just looks really neat. Tried to bring up the tool wheel again. <laughs> See if I can catch any fish in here. I know the painter guy's above us. We'll get there. We'll get there. Maybe get it out of the deep water? Can I catch anything? Maybe I just have to stand still. Oh, she just sits down no matter what. That's really cute. No? Oh. No way. They really make you wait for it. What is it? Pumpkin seed? Cute! Okay, easy. Go that far. Alright, one more. We'll wait for it. Perhaps. We'll get there. This game is teaching me patience. I'm fine with it. Are you fine with it? Because I'm fine with it. Is it still snowing out? There's not enough lights in my parking lot. <laughs> I can't tell. Yeah, get a good stretch in there, Claire. There you go. Eat. Okay. Oh, gee. Okay, well, turn around. Turn around every time I get a little bit of that, you know that song? <laughs> My brain only stores like a quarter of the information per song, like <laughs> for songs like that, like just general songs you hear on the radio. That's all I have, that's all I've got for that. <laughs> all right, we still need four more. Let's go find the painter guy. Excuse me. Friend! I love tasks like this, by the way. Uh, they're, speaking of Mario Odyssey, they have one in Mario Odyssey like this, like where you just have to find them in different locations. The little, the little dude from the Sand Kingdom, you gotta find him in all the other different kingdoms. He takes a taxi to all over the, the universe. <laughs> it's very cute. And then you get rewarded every time. And then he's like, hey, my friend! I'm so happy to see you. I just want to give you a gift. It's really cute. <laughs> Nothing's been working so far. I finally got invited to show my work in the city. But everyone there is doing an amazing contemporary work. I don't know if I can keep up. Just do your stuff, dude. You should be proud of it. You're doing amazing. Ian Artsworth, famous contemporary artist, personally invited me. Okay, that means he likes your stuff. That means he likes your stuff, hon. This fails to resonate with me. <laughs> Karate chopped them in half! Man, anxiety be like, <laughs> he could! He's also a black belt, so it's definitely possible. <laughs> Outlook point. Okay. I've become your biggest fan. I'm gonna follow you to all of your endeavors. Oh. Hello. Another, oh, another one? Okay. All right. I 
I don't really know what building she's talking about, but... I got stuck in the trees, it's fine. Is it the building that I, that when I first found like this area that I was like, holy shit, there's a new area. It's not, it's this one? It is this one, okay. Okay, yeah, no, let's rematch. I could totally do that. Yeah, I can do that, no problem. Now that I know where we're going, easy peasy. And I got my lucky hat on. I'm just gliding, dude. I'm not even gonna waste my time on the ground. Got that silver feather, it makes me all fast. Okay, and then we go down to this little flower dude thingy. Yes. Yes. Where is it? Over here. Okay. And then I can just climb, right? Yeah. Easy. Boom. Done. Boom jams. Good, good luck, kid. Well, what do you mean? Like, should I beat you again? Yeah, Rocky? You hear his little piggy snorts? He's so cute. Oh, he's a little piggy. Did I tell you guys I got him a new sweater? I think I did. I think I told you that the other day. Dude, what? He's ki She's killing it! Oh, okay. I don't know what she's doing, but... Oh, is she bouncing up? Oh, I think I see. I still won. <laughs> but that was pretty good. A valiant effort, I must say. A speed demon! Another medal. Nice. Bye. Uh, what were we doing? <laughs> doing other shit. Um... Ooh, a treasure chest. More coinage, thank you. Let's go find our our scheming, thieving friend and help him pay for his college tuition. Oh, and we also want to go to the top of Outer Post and go see our artist friend. Okay, went up a little too high. Yep. Yeah, I'll just give you money. I don't know. Yeah, I just found it. <laughs> Here you go, bud. Ooh, a wristwatch. It's gonna sell it on the internet. Oh, that's the. <gasps> it's the mouse's watch. It's the- it's Mr. Mouse's watch! Oh my god, it's all coming together. Whoa! It's really good! You're killing it! I'm so proud of this raccoon fella. You've got such a cool style. Why are you so hard on yourself? Is this what people feel like in the art industry, in the visual art industry? Because this is how people act in the music industry. <laughs> oh, I gotta stretch my leg out. Oh, God. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez, Rick. Oh, okay. I want people to feel- Well, I just said I was feeling something. I keep co Yeah! I keep complimenting you! It makes me happy. If I had that on my wall, I'd look at it every day. Oh, what a nice thing to say. Yep, they invited you because they know your work is good. They know what type of things you paint. I 
head back to where I started. Uh, okay, I think I remember where that was. We gotta find Mr. Mouse first, though. He was in the little trailer park area. Oh, buddy. Guess the fuck what. Yes, that's it! Oh, yay! Dude, nice! We're incredible. We're unstoppable. We're gonna kick that little girl's ass at the next <laughs> race that she wants to have. <laughs> hey, do you have any more strawberries yet? You have anything out? Oh. Hey, bud. Ranger John gonna be in this painting? Oh, that's nice. Because he's the best. Aww. Oh, he's a little ram! Oh, cute. <sighs> yeah! Just paint when you want to paint, baby! You're a part of the park, too. I just want to capture all aspects of the park. How do you write dialogue like this? I can't believe how sweet games like this turn out. Wow, we are just killing it. We are just doing amazing. Even the watered down rainy painting. Yeah, it's fun. It's all part of the experience. You paint all the random shit you want, like pandas on a tightrope or some shit. Exactly. You get it. <laughs> Nice. Okay. We did it with him. Nice. Oh. Um. What does this one do? Um, let's go to Gulliver. Let's sell some fishies. I don't know where, uh... Ooh, there's another seashell. So let me have it. Thank you. Might be faster to run. Land. Do the thing. Okay. Nice. Just cut... Cut across, just cut across a little bit. And then we have to, we still have to finish the game. We have to go back to our house and take a nap. I got turned around. I get confused in this game. <laughs> so this is our house, and then Gulliver's right next to it, so. Oh, yeah, bud? Just snoring, snoring away like a little aminal. That's cool. I forgot we could like jump for each feather that we have. Nice. Gulliver, you're not going to believe this. Ten coins. Okay. I mean, not that we're like doing anything. For, we're not doing. I don't. I don't even know what to do with this money. <laughs> nice. Personal favorite. I'll trade you fifteen coins. God damn. Ah. 
Okay. I don't know, uh... I don't know where else to catch those fish. I bet we could catch them up in the, in the mountains. In the snowy areas. But right now, I'm gonna go back to our house. Yeah, I think we helped everybody. The only person who we didn't finish their, uh... Their little quest was, um... The little racing parkour. Little lady. Um, here we go. Woo! Everything was okay. Your mom's a tough bird and you should be alright. Well, glad somebody knew. Sleep. No! Oh! Well, <laughs> there you have it. What a good game. GG's all around. Agreed. Josh, thank you for the recommendation. Um, told you you can beat this in one stream. Yeah, no, you're totally right, Mels. Yeah, this ripped. This was great. Great soundtrack, great gameplay, super cute to look at. Love all the characters. It was like a more lighthearted night in the woods, you know? Which I'm, I'm interested in playing soon, if anyone else is interested in hanging out for that. Because uh, I saw a playthrough of that once years and years ago, and I really liked it, and I've always wanted to play it. Um, but it kind of reminded me of that, that kind of like spunkiness of the characters, you know? But this was like a little bit more lighthearted. The other one's a little bit more sassy and sarcastic. Um, this fucking ruled. I had a great time. Uh, you know what tomorrow is? Undertale. And I cannot wait. I miss Undertale so bad. It's gonna be so fun. I love that game. We've been, we've been like, we've been knocking them out of the park lately. Everything that, that we've been playing, I've been really enjoying. I think they just make good video games these days, you know? <laughs> um, thank you all for hanging out. This was lovely, cozy, comfy happy it's just it was all around freaking wonderful so thank you um i love you have a good night